Castlevania 2 Simon's Quest. This game sucks. Yeah, this game does suck. What a horrible night. What a curse. This game is atrocious. If you thought Castlevania was hard, if you thought Castlevania was tough, this game, oh boy, this game, ooh, you will grind your teeth. There will be wailing and gnashing of teeth because of this game. This game, oh boy, these text boxes, they suck. They're awful. I swear, you won't be able to read a thing anybody says in this game. Except for when that stupid night comes and that horrible sun comes out. Oh man, and don't get me started with the water. The water and the stairs. Horrible. Oh, you will die so many times trying to just jump and you'll go into the water you will die oh it is so terrible you are gonna hate it castlevania 1 is a hundred times better than this game look at this bull crap there the enemies are hitting me and they're hitting me back into the first screen and these enemies are so hard where do i go what do I do? I need Nintendo Power. This is a Nintendo Power type of game. Oh boy, these enemies, they are relentless. They will kill you. They will not stop until you are dead. And where do I go? The townspeople are worthless. The townspeople don't tell me a thing. Oh, I just want to figure out where to go, what to do in this game, and I can't. I died again. Oh, you will die so much in this game. And look at this. Look at the slowdown. Oh, what a horrible night to have a curse. Indeed, this game is a curse. Oh, Castlevania 2. And these, these zombie things, these monsters in the town, they're so much stronger than the normal enemies. I don't understand it. I don't understand it. And you gotta collect these stupid hearts? You gotta collect these stupid hearts to get the stupid items in the stupid game. Oh my lord. Oh, this game is so cri cryptic. Cryptic. Look at that. The water. Ah. Seriously, though, this game is so difficult. I didn't know where to go. I didn't know where to go as a kid. No idea. I didn't play this game as a kid. And if I did, I would have thrown my controller against the wall and broke it. And I would have probably broken the NES. I would have taken the game out, smashed it with a hammer. This game... Oh, what a horrible night. What a horrible night indeed. This is the worst game in the series. Now you got Castlevania Judgment. That craft's better than this. The newer Castlevanias are better than this. The 64 games are better than this. Play the 64 games. Those games are atrocious too. But I'm going to tell you, this game sucks. This game is awful. Does it belong in the NES Classic Edition? No! No! It does not! They should have put Castlevania 3! They should have put Castlevania 3 on here instead of that crap. I mean, I would have taken Contra Force over this. I mean, I would have taken Dr. Jekyll and Mr. Hyde. I mean, oh wait, no, no, I wouldn't have. <sighs> this game. <sighs> this water... These mermen, oh, oh, this game, this is probably the only game on the set that I, I think doesn't belong in the NES. 
you're gonna hate it. You're gonna punish yourself. You're gonna go through some torture. Castlevania 2. Castlevania 2. You need to go away, you cursed game. You horrid game. You're gonna watch me struggle. You're gonna watch me go through the levels and just not make it. I don't know where to go. I need my Nintendo power. Well, anyway, that was me channeling angry video game nerd. Of course, without the curse words. Of course, not as crude. And that was my little tribute to him. And not as good. I can't do angry, guys. I cannot really do angry. And this game truly is not that great. Uh, playing it in retrospective, it's not that good. I did not play it as a kid. And I'm glad I didn't. Now, it does have kind of, you know, an adventure type to it than the first one. Castlevania 1 is more linear. Maybe you'll like that. Maybe you won't. Maybe you'll figure out the puzzles. I don't know. Maybe you'll have fun with it. Now, there is a redacted version out there that you can, you can find, you can buy, and play on the NES. And apparently, that version is really, really well done. And it, it fixes a lot of the problems. Check it out on Angry Video Game Nerds uh, channel. James Rolfe, he does a wonderful job of it. And... You know, guys, if it wasn't for him, you know, I, I dedicate this video to him. If it wasn't for him, I probably wouldn't even want to try YouTube. And I've watched him from the beginning since 2006. And, you know, keep it up, James. Thanks for inspiring me. And this video is for you. Um, does this game belong on the NES Classic? Well, I would say yes and no. If they would have included all three Castlevanias like they should have I would say absolutely yes include all three but I could have taken or left this game and maybe added something else on there but yeah let me know what you guys think can you get anywhere in this game can you figure out this game without a strategy guide or a Nintendo power does this game make you angry does it make you want to yell throw your controller and vent does it make you feel like you have a curse on your soul after playing it the red tornado and all that cryptic crap let me know down in the comments below do you think it belongs on the nes classic edition also if you're not subscribed to me please do so this was kind of a different review for me just kind of a fun one trying to emulate one of my heroes and probably didn't do too hot, but oh well. Thanks for watching, guys. As always, enjoy the rest of this footage. And as always, I hope you have a great rest of your night.